Today we're at the um, second Mayor of Rochdale's charity dig and it's for a few good causes so that what the Mayor wants to put it to is Spring Hill Hospice and a few other things. So there's quite a lot of people here, quite some really good prizes at the raffle so I'll make sure I bought raffle tickets, I'll be up there winning them. And um, so we're just going to see what we can find. <laughs> Find of the day. I thought it was a button, but it seems to be embedded in this uh, mud or whatever. I can't get it out. So uh, I'll just have to take the whole blob home. But yeah, that's my first signal. Summit stuck in a blob of summit. I thought I had my first silver then. Where I didn't, it was just a lid with a bit of silver on the top. But um, <laughs> it was good for us while it lasted. So we've been here about 10 minutes and the heavens have opened like it always does in Manchester. So we found some trees to shelter under. So it's quite nice under here. A lot of people will have sheltered under here, Twiggy. We want to give this a go. Yeah. There's probably stuff down here, isn't there? Yeah. Some tickets for the raffle. I've got I've got ten pounds worth. I am. Sweep, have, have you yeah. bought some as well? <laughs> what are you sick of us? You want to win the GoPro? <laughs> oh <laughs> how many have you got? Ten pounds worth, so you've got ten pounds worth of raffle tickets. Well, good luck, sweep. I hope you do win a GoPro and you can go out on your own then instead of annoying us. Well, I'm just stood here thinking about the more positive sides of life. Um, rain makes signals a little bit better, so don't be put off by going out in the rain if you're new because um, the, the, it does make the signals and a bit better and it makes the ground a bit easier to dig. Get a bit full of mud, but that's a bit of fun, isn't it? Twiggy's got his first spoon, bring it over because I'm not leaving these trees, so have a look at it. Absolutely leathering it down. Oh, it's a complete spoon. Is it silver though? I don't think so. No. It's just a rubbish spoon, isn't it? It's, it's got a bit of silver shining through. No, it's just been plated. It looks fairly modern as well, that, to be honest. Anyway, it's spoon of the day, because we have to have a spoon every time we come out, don't we? Spoon of the day. Definitely something. It might be part of a candlestick, like you say. Yeah, possibly. Are you looking? Is there more in the hole? No. Oh. So that's it. Oh well, it's either a bell then, or a bit, a, or a candlestick holder, or something. Oh, that's a nice artifact. You'd be able to tell when you get the mud out if it's got a donger in it. I think it'll have a donger in it. it. Might have a donger. Sun's coming out a bit now. It's looking a bit nice. I just thought I found another silver coin. But didn't it was um, that? I haven't found that now, I don't know what it is, but uh, it's part of a buckle to be honest. Oops, right, I've just been having a chat with that man there behind me, and he's just told me that in that field there, just in front of that hedge that's in front of me, can I show, in fact, I'll show you there, that hedge there, that um, somebody has found a Roman rolled up thingy and some sort of Roman horsey thingy. So, I don't know what I'm wasting my time in here for. I better get in there quick. I want some at Roman. Imagine if I get it Roman. And I'm having a lucky day. So, I think I'll probably find something. Ooh, can you see in there? I think I found my first coin there. Can you see it? It's well stuck in. Let's get it out. Oh, yeah, I have. Oh, coin in the old twiggy. I don't know. It's a penny of some sort, I think. Well, it is. I'm not sure if you can see it, but it's a 1916 George V penny. So that will be from First World War. Hanging signal. Not looked at it yet. Can see it's quite a big thick one. Big thick one. Big thick one. What are you? What are you, big thick one? Uh, that's got to be George III, that, from the size of it. Let me give it a clean. This is better than I could have hoped for. Do you know what it is? It is a druid's head penny. And I can tell it's like the druid's head there. And then the back of it, I'll, I'll clean up when I get... It's got like lines on it. So it's from about 1735. I think that might be in for find of the day, that. That's superb. 
I know we've got one because Twiggy found one on top of the moors that time, so that's how I know what it is. But yeah, it drew his head, Penny. Who'd have expected that here? Well, chuff with that, I think that might be um, find of the day up to now because I think it was about 1738 or something like that. So it's a few hundred year old, that. Ooh, good on me. Got a penny now. First coin, that for me. Be true about the wet because look, I've got another one. Got another one. Uh, 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 what is it? What are you? Well, I know what that is because I've had so many of them, even though I can't identify it. It's a George the Third, Apney from 1806. I get them all the time. They're like my wrinkles. Every day I get one of them. Another one. I'm a coin monster. I don't know what this one is. It's a bit smaller. Ooh. Ooh. Coin number four. Already, I think I might win most coins at day. So that's Vicky Bunhead Apney now. So I don't, I can't see the date, but I can definitely see Vicky Bunhead. So that's Queen Victoria. Looks with me today. I don't think anybody's had four coins yet, like I've done. I've not even been here yet, long, very long. So I, I'm hoping that I win a, something good in the raffle as well. Um, I think I might win the GoPro, and I might win a bottle of vodka. I imagine that would just make my day. So four coins in the pock, it, and um, I fancy winning that. So we've got an hour before the raffle. Must have been biggest hole of the day. Um, and it was just that, it took ages to find that. So I'm not sure what that is. It might be off a draw handle or something. Not sure. <laughs> So I just thought I'd do a bit of sheltering near this nice pond until um, past half an hour till I win my prize. I definitely don't go to win it. He's had two, four <laughs> butties, two bags of crisps. So greedy. Did you find it? I did this the other week. And then there, I oh, you're feeling, feeling lucky, sweet. You're feeling lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Kick it. Cut your sweep, sweep. It's the first prize again. It's been redonated back from the spotlight. Oh, oh, you're back in a chance, sweep. Oh, otherwise we'll never get away, will we? It's <laughs> your popularity. Oh, here we go. This is the one. Yeah. 46 to 50. An early... Sweep, you won it. Well done, sweep. Come and get it, sweep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can pull it back in a minute because Dawn wants alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet, can you believe it? Twiggy's bought you that. And you Twiggy? Yeah. Oh, look. <laughs> Two, three, six. <laughs> Two, three, six. I knew he was going to get a GoPro today, Sweet, but just knew it. <laughs> It really, it wasn't really sweet, was it? But sweet wants it, don't you, sweet? Well done, winning a GoPro. Excellent. I said that this morning, didn't we? Needed to win that GoPro. You said you wanted it. Well, what's yours is mine. What's yours is mine. Still, still got the vodka to go, sweet. Seventy-six to eighty. Yay! <laughs> well done, sweet. You got some nice pictures, didn't you? Over it. It seems okay. Next one, 51 to 55. Is that you again? Yeah. 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 Good, Twiggy. Oh, I'm clearing up today. We always clear. Anything else? Sell yourself, Sweet. Yeah. 396 to 400. <laughs> He's got another one, hasn't he? Lucky old Twiggy. Great dig this, isn't it, Dave? It is. 45 people turned up. Very nice. Mayor was here and he enjoyed it. Loads of prizes. So thank you to everyone for that. And uh, thank you, Dawn, for coming and promoting the event as well. Well, I want to thank you for bringing your lovely children. What's your name? My name's Lily. Lily. And what's your name? Mason. Mason's just asked me if I'd actually bought the sandwiches or shoplifted them, didn't you, Mason? So we've got she's been a lovely shopkeeper today, aren't you? Sweeps help in there. Watch he don't eat the ham butties because he steals things in. <laughs> Look, he's 
street continuing after your um, our raffle wins. I felt a bit bad then, did you? Yeah, I felt very guilty. You felt guilty? I thought perhaps Lucia will give that GoPro away, eh? What do you reckon? Right, next find that. Can't believe I found that. I won that GoPro. I don't win. I don't win an awful lot, mate. But uh, I was staggered by that. In fact, I feel a bit guilty, to be honest. A bit of shrapnel, that. Can you have a look at each other, please, off a bomb? So that's, that's a bit of shrapnel. We know it from these lines, so if you get any bits like that with lines on it, it's uh, shrapnel off a bomb. I definitely know that for sure. Yeah, have your shrapnel back. Bomb shrapnel. Have your bit of a bomb. You know when you're supposed to go um, near White Feather and, it, and it's lucky? I found some, just going to show you. There they are, you can't get more White Feathers than that. Trouble is, they might be trying to peck me. But I want to go over there because I think they'll be silver. So I'm going to try and tackle the geese, see what happens. Back on my coins, I reckon. In here. Oh, is that it? Oh, that's another one. And that one is, um, I can see Britannia there. What? George the Third? Silver? Twiggy's got a George the Third. I don't know what that is, but it's not as good as George the Third. Twiggy's got a George the Third, ain't he? But surprisingly, it's in very good condition. You can see that. Mm. That's good condition, that. Is On the it? back, yeah. So that's 1806 or 1807. Hey, we're going to have loads of coins, aren't we? You can see, even see Britannia. I mean, it's rare to see her on back. The date will say 1806 or 1807 because it's only two year dates. Yeah, it's six. 1806. 1806. Brilliant. Have, have, you, have you got another kind? Yeah, it might not be. Oh, it looks like a Vicky, that. One head, yeah. One head. One head, eight, Nick. I've got one of them. I think that's a lead fishing weight. Quite near a pond, which is just through there, so um, yeah, I think that's a lead fishing weight. Found some of there's definitely something. There's definitely some of that, I can just see it at the bottom, but it's quite deep. Don't stab it. Don't stab it. I think it looks like a George III, ain't it? It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, it looks like a spill of them. Oh no, there was another green. Oh, it's a bit of grass that. I thought it was another one. Oh, it's bright green that one, isn't it? Is there any more in there? Well, looks. What's that other bit stuck in your hand? Is that a bit of soil oh, off it? Yeah. It's very green. Oh, oh it's knackered that. Isn't yeah. It? Probably George the first that. No, oh, I'm just telling that now. Looks like it's uh, silver plated at one time, it's a button. You can just see a bit of silver uh, plate on there, but that's about it. Are you clodding a chod? Clodding a chod? I'm just having to sit down, me. It's lovely now. Right, go on. Come on. Oh, oh, it's exciting, this, isn't it? It's like Christmas. <laughs> oh, 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 which half is it in? Oh. Oh, I can think I can see some out there. Is it round? Oh, it is round. Oh, oh it's, a it's a button. Oh, I didn't know that, did I? No, well, it could have been a bit of gold. But anyway. So that's it. Thanks for sharing your excitement with us, Twiggy. <laughs> of you finding your button. Well, it's not a button, it's a washer. A that's washer. Cool. It's even less exciting. It's even worse, isn't it? <laughs> Fantastic day that was, so thanks very much Dave Sadler for putting that charity dig on and I hope we made lots of money. Look at Twiggy, you still can't believe it, he's won a GoPro. And I, I got them hand-drawn pictures that I'm going to put the pictures on now and let you see them, aren't they beautiful? And then he's got a, um, a t-shirt and a hat and I've got a, an oil burner and a, a white bag. So we did it, in fact we felt embarrassed at one point because we were winning that much raffle. But um, they said, well you paid for it, we might as well get them. So, what a fantastic day for coins, and a fantastic day all round, really enjoyed it. So, till next time, dig it, dig, dig, dig. She wears lipstick, he has muscles, they sure ain't been digging the troubles. Out there, detectives waving around, finding lots of stuff on the ground. 
Maybe silver or even gold They have a story to be told Watch them now if you have a chance If you find some silver, you'll do a dance See them on the YouTube show